I don't think it can really go well. Today's ingredients consist of some corn flour, which is probably too good for this, Happy Shopper brand custard creams, meerkats, which are supposed to resemble some sort of sweet, shani, I'm not really sure what that is, some milk, <laughs> questionable bread product, and some icing sugar. Right, let's start. <laughs> Get a bit of action on that. <laughs> Is it actually lit? I can see heat coming off of it. It's very hard to tell. Yeah, that's lit. Ow. Let's get going then. Let's fucking go. Let's put some questionable Middle Eastern origin fizzy drink in a pot and boil it for some reason. Good. Good vintage. It's almost like it came out of the shop this morning. Right, so boil that for 10 hours. Did we, did we measure anything out? No. Yeah, it's fine then. Right, I'll add corn flour. Oh, good lord. It should help it thicken. Or we could use the correct ingredients for a trifle. What? Oh, yeah. That already looks absolutely disgusting! Oh, it's clumping. That's not good. Yeah, I'm not surprised. That's... I'm sure most people don't do cooking with workshop gloves on, but... Do you want to get this on your skin? No. I think it might melt my skin, to be honest. Oh god, it's got a it's got a weird colour. You supposed to put that in before it boils then? Well as we bring it to the boil. Oh god, the smell. <laughs> I think wise idea doing this outside. It's not, look at that colour though. That absolutely stinks. I think this is gonna make a delicious trifle at this rate. Why did you do shanny just because you were drinking it that evening. Well, it's mixed fruit. That's what you put in oh, the trifle. Yeah, right. I'll, I'll let you off. Yeah. Um, right. Well, that is uh, a mechanic of sorts. Definitely not a cook. Oh, well, that is doing that. Uh, I suppose you should start on uh, the base. What, mashing up. I oh, know that comes later. Well, that comes later. Yeah, after custard. It's made it quite a delicious colour. Mm. Uniform. They don't actually look that terrible. You need an anvil for this. Yes. If you don't have a chopping board, use yeah. the nearest anvil <laughs> that you can <laughs> find. Anvil you can find. Uh, that's like sponge fingers. Look, that's, that is a sponge finger already. This is going better than expected. Oh. You just want to line your bowl with your burger bun. You're saying this like it's a recipe that other people might actually want to follow. In, wouldn't you? Well, I'll tell you in, when it's finished. Oh, it's making a skin. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, so it's, is that setting to the bottom? That's setting to the bottom a little bit. I'll give that a good stir. There we go. It is thickening somewhat. I mean, it's thicker than when we started. I put the knife down so I cut myself. Probably need the pain to take your eye off of this stuff. Stop being so negative. I don't like how it's got a thicker, darker bit in the middle of it. It's kind of concerning. Wow. It looks like some sort of soup that's gone terribly wrong. Oh my god, it's like. Ugh. It's two colours. I don't know how it's gone two tone. Is so there going to be enough in there? It be enough. A little custard to come after this, so, you know. Well, when you say custard, you mean custard creams. Close enough. Mashed up on an anvil. I mean, the rules were, 
no... Oh, God. What, what have we created? Not really sure. Let's have a look. Lovely. I won't eat that yet. Or ever. It's still going thick and glue. It's actually making pieces of fruit, because I'm not entirely sure how <laughs> that's possible. This is how fruit <laughs> is made. Oh, good God. This might be a horrible mistake. I said that from the start. But you don't know until you try. Hmm. I might need more corn flour. Oh, because that'll definitely, definitely fix it, won't it? It's thickening. Look at that. That is thick. So thick! It's thicker than it was. It's not exactly thick, though, is it? I mean, we've got other things to repair in the meantime, so it's not like this is going to hamper it's our really, progress. It's not like it's on a rolling boil yet, is it? It's just going to start mashing us biscuits. Yes. It smells like a chemical toilet at a festival. I'll take that off the heat for a bit before it burns. That is thickened nicely though, look at that. If any of the 200 and something subscribers that I have on my other mysterious channel find out about ever, this, ever see this, <laughs> they recognise my hat and possibly my voice. Why do you feel wearing gloves? <laughs> Who knew an anvil was such a useful kitchen tool? Everyone should have one. <laughs> there we go. Look at that. Look at like custard. That's delicious custard. Sort of. Oh, he didn't take all of the pocket. Oh, oh, I might do too much. Oh, no. Oh, dear. The bag has ceased to be, unfortunately. OK, all right. So now we add some that. fluid. This isn't sponsored, just saying. Is that actually San Pellegrino in there, yes. or is it water? Oh, right. It's very old San Pellegrino. Excellent. This is lost all its feet. I'm sure that's not a problem. Alright, now I've got to carefully stir this. <laughs> so this is your custard, is it? This is this will be our custard. It actually looks like custard, actually. It's more than I thought it might. You might um, sort of. Yeah, I mean, oh. you squint. Yeah. For about 500 metres, you would say that's custard. If you squint and then get maced, then maybe that would look like custard. <laughs> oh, good God. What are we doing? I think sick is the word I'd use to describe that. Oh, don't do that. <laughs> what? They're going everywhere. Well, burn really... this table after you've finished. We've really got to combine the flavours. What is in harmony? San Pellegrino and custard creams. You're actually going to have some shabby. Better than nothing, isn't it? Oh, you're so brave. <laughs> it's interesting, isn't it? Oh, well, we've got some shabby concentrate. <laughs> concentrate. <laughs> right, I think we don't need the turmeric. I thought we might need to. Oh, thank again. God for that, right. But it's all, maybe a little bit. No. Just don't do that. Oh, you. Hey, that, that should just give us the colour we need. Right, now we need another bowl for all the milk and the icing sugar to make the cream. Well, then you know where they are. <laughs> Is this bowl big enough for all of this? Um, well, if it's not, we're going to have to eat a lot more. <laughs> I'm not eating. <laughs> I will try it, but. You're trying it. Oh, brave you. So you're not then. Uh, this, this is some icing sugar. No, it's not cocaine, I promise. I mean, it's entirely legitimate because it's got it written on there in permanent marker. <laughs> Nobody could possibly doubt that. Right. I'm actually using a whisk. I'm not even sure what icing sugar does in milk, but we're going to find out. I know, I tell you, I know, I tell you what it does do is it makes a bloody mess. It's, it's fine. Instead of making a latte, to be honest. God, for 
so, for, considering neither of us ever drink coffee, that's... Um, I do. Oh, do you? Oh, not a posh Costa one. No. How much of that are you going to put in there? I think it's going to be quite a bit. We are going to thicken it, remember, into a cream. You're wasting ingredients on something that's going to be absolutely disgusting. I'm quite impressed. It's, it is basically a jam. I'm glad you're impressed. It sure doesn't taste like jam. Have you tried it? No. Well, yeah, it's tried in a minute, so yeah. Well, you've only put it in the fridge to set over time. Oh. You want to get those layers. This really isn't thickening that much. What, did you expect it to? Oh, with just icing sugar, yeah. Keep chucking it in there. We're just going to end up with a clumpy mess. That's all of that gone then. Well, I've got more than. Oh. We've got more. If we really. There, that's more. Like it. That's thickening now. All I see here is tons of sugar. I mean, it's going to be a very sweet meal. I mean, it is a dessert, so you know. Yeah. <laughs> it's also got an off white colour. But... Death by sugar. But, um. Really? It's just a little bit more cold there. Jesus. Two shots of vodka. Oh. It's gonna need more. It's, it's, yeah, it's not bad. Is it? Oh, for God's sake. But it needs to float on the surface. Have you got more of that? Or? Probably. Whoa, steady on, mate. That's, that's more than enough. That's, there we go. Oh, we're, we're getting there now. Look at that. That looks like what comes out of a fire extinguisher. Right, get all that edge bit. Yeah, there we go. Drum, is it going to set like green? I don't think it will set as such. I think it is going to sort of separate, possibly. Actually, wait a minute. No, we should be alright. Based on what? Um, science? <laughs> Remember, right. Remember learning that at school. Assembly time. Oh, look at that. Right. Because people like whole lots of fruit in their tribe, for some um, reason, we have some meerkats. This is all we could find. Yeah. One oh, pound. Bloody. One pound thirty-nine. Then. Good lord. <laughs> the chemicals in that. So um, just a few of them. <laughs> <laughs> just like to point out as well that these are beheaded meerkats. Most of them. As you, as you can see there. Well, there's also this one there, it's it got their legs. Yeah. It's, it's beheaded, yeah. It's their legs. It's... There we go, just, don't need any of them. Just, just add bits of fruit in. Now... Mmm! The, uh... Yes, whatever that is. The thickened shanny. Shanny paste. It's gonna... Oh, good lord. It's going to act as our sort of jam or jelly or whatever you call it. And then let's get spread that out. There we go. There we go. That's, that's looking like a trifle, kind of. Were you drunk when you had this idea? Um. I don't know. No. Uh, Possibly my drinking's getting up, catching up with me. Because I'm here on a Jimmy Black holiday, making this. Yes, while everybody else is out at the beach or having a party in the street. Because that's what British people do. Yeah, but trifles very British. Well, you've got the red and the white in there anyway, if not the blue, but still. Mmm. <laughs> oh, God. It's, um, yeah, that's, that's a trifle. So how long, how long are you going to leave it to set? Well, let's go go in the fridge for at least an hour or so. And so we, we can do this, put in. it in the fridge, and go out and have lunch, and then come back. Yeah, then, well, we've got to have lunch, get drunk, and then see if we no. can forget about it. <laughs> forget the pain? I right, taking the bloody bus home. <laughs> Don't taste it, I won't smell. <laughs> it's fine. Actually, like... It actually tastes fine. Oh, my God. Try a bit. Um. You're a liar. No, I thought it was alright. I've had worse things than that. It tastes like wallpaper paste. 
When have you been eating wallpaper paste? You would be surprised. Uh-huh. <laughs> right, custard. Just gonna clog up all of my like breathing apparatus. Breathing apparatus? <laughs> go, oh yes. Mmm. Always love a turmeric in that. That would be good. For oh people. god. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. That is thick. Mm. That's a lot of custard layer. Or should I say custard layer? <laughs> custard cream layer. And then uh, finally the cream layer. I ain't gonna get all that in there, mate. It's just going straight to the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> well, we carry on, we persevere. Don't make it too full, you've got to carry it to the fridge. No, no, just chuck all of it in, why not? Yeah! Voila! I think you could leave that in the fridge for a year and it will still be a runny, shitty mess. It looks like a trifle. From... <laughs> See? You get far enough away <laughs> from it. No, that kind of looks like a trifle. Meanwhile, at the Legion of Doom. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Did you actually think it was going to set? 50-50. Well, I think there's more zero. Really not amused by this plan. Not at all. Are you dishing it up then? Do I have to? <laughs> this was entirely your doing, I'd just like to make this clear. <laughs> oh. Uh, oh my god, it has set. <laughs> it's like a rubber puck. <laughs> I'm not having that much. Fuck off. It's actually set like a solid layer of shabby. Mm. There we go. Nice, nice big serving for you. <laughs> it has some resistance in the bottom there. Resistance? Resistance is useless. <laughs> look, look at it. Oh god. <laughs> okay. What's that fucking fluorescent red? This is your fault. Yeah, this is 98% my fault. That's... Right, make sure you get the jelly. What's the red shit? The fluorescent? The shammy. Is that sh No, that's the shammy. What's this fucking stuff? I don't know. <laughs> we didn't have anything that colour. <laughs> it's changed colour in the fridge. <laughs> That could be turmeric, but that's orange. I, oh, I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> I don't know anymore. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, good grief. Listen to the noise it makes. It doesn't make any noise. It's like paste. I've got to be grown ups. This is for science. I'm not getting a big bit. Ready? Right, three. Are we going on go? I don't know. On go. Three, two, one, go. <coughs> That's the most disgusting thing I've ever put in my mouth. I just don't think it's that bad. What? Honestly, I'm fine. It's like you saw dust with... I think that's alright. What? <laughs> You're mental. <laughs> I actually don't think that's that bad. The jelly's like Turkish delight. My eyes are watering. <laughs> oh, what's that bit? Oh, that's from the bread. I think it's not that bad. Are you just saying that, or do you actually... <laughs> Genuinely not that bad. It's not perfect, but... It could be far worse. I feel the fox bite eating some of this. No, you, you like it. It's yours now. <coughs> you it's... might return it. Might return it? I mean, it depends on the restaurant. I mean, if it's like one of those restaurants that's like very snooty, you might think it's like twice about it, but if it's like a restaurant like McDonald's, you don't even bother. 
<laughs> we are not doing this again. Yes. Make us all good. <laughs> I'm good, I'm good. I'm happy, so. <laughs>